What's good, YouTube? Back in the video, we got UDY. Is he cheating on her with his fans? Now, I ain't gonna lie. If you're a cheater, bro, you're a bad person, bro. If you're gonna cheat, just be single, bro. Anyways, in 2024, you should just be single anyways, bro. But if you're gonna cheat, just be single, bro. But let's get into this video. Let's see what happens. Let's get it. All right. I feel like he would have gotten suspicious. He's always out it. here in LA for gigs. And like, what is he gonna expect? I mean, to drive all the way to here? True. Oh, I'm gonna come all the way out here to spawn him? He'll probably yeah. think like, oh, I'm in another city. There's no way she's gonna know. <sighs> Today we're helping Christina test her boyfriend's loyalty. His name Christina. is Tristan. On a scale of one to 10, how confident are you that he's going to pass the test? Will Tristan remain loyal to Christina, or will he end up trading and cheating on her with our decoy? I hope you guys got your talkies for this one, because you guys already know. This is going to be good. All right, will Suppose he Christina cheat, bro? Tristan are driving all the way from Let's Las see. Vegas to LA today for this loyalty test, separately, of course. Now, we did consider filming out there, but decided that it'd just be better to shoot out here. So hopefully they both get here safely. My boyfriend's a musician, mm -hmm. and he does gigs. He gets paid to like sing and play at events. Uh -huh. But there's so many girls at these places, and mm -hmm. I have no clue what he does. And I just so you, so you don't have like any trust in him whatsoever. I want to have trust in him, but the feelings I get, I I just I don't know. In order to further understand why Christina wanted to test her boyfriend, you guys gotta understand her past. This girl has not had the best luck with guys. Any other like previous relationships that you've experienced, like some guys doing you dirty or anything like that? Yeah, always. 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 Yes. Always. Always. Every dude just wants to hit and leave. No. That's it. Jail. I ain't gonna lie, that's a sign, bro. If that keep happening to you, bro, just stop trying to get a boyfriend. Use your brain for once. Come and on, bro. Jail. And so the previous one I had lasted 12 days. Well. But no. <laughs> Listen, we were going out days, like seven bro. months, and he asked me to be oh his girlfriend before. He, no, trust. He asked me to be his girlfriend before. I said no because I had these feelings and then I finally said yes because he was the only guy I'm with and I'm like, okay, I, I have fun with him. And then I'm like, I'm looking through his Instagram following and I'm like, oh, there's a bunch of models and stars on here. <gasps> oh. Immediately out. I sent him the screenshots. I'm like, yeah, I can't do this. Models and That way a meat beater for real, for and real. <laughs> are you friends with her? <laughs> she doesn't know you. You are a fan and you're following her. So as you guys can see, Christina's pretty that boy's a things. However, with Tristan, it's a little different. Being that he's a musician and he performs at different venues, he's bound to meet and follow other girls. Is he following these girls for networking and professional reasons, though? Or is it for pleasure? It's his job. So I get he follows other girls. Yeah. You know? So that's obviously I'm not going to cut you off immediately. That's yeah. your job. But, you know, what are you doing behind closed doors? So you've caught him lying to you before? I always ask him these questions, like, oh, you know, where are you going? Who are you with? And he's not telling me. He's always trying to beat around the bush. And then saying, oh, well, you're a model. You're going to the similar parties, so why are you getting mad at me? Now, as you guys just heard, Christina models. So given their work life, I think it's fair to say that these two have a bit of a back and forth relationship where one is accusing the other of talking to someone else. I think he's just trying to save himself gotcha. yeah, by making me the problem. Have you guys ever like tried to talk about boundaries, like things you can do, can't do, what's appropriate, what's not? We have talked about it, but okay. honestly, I just can't tell. He follows so many girls. When you do shoots with guys, do you follow them on Instagram after? Like sometimes I do. Okay, but I mean, I don't so know. So what's the problem? I feel like it's always different with girls, you know? Like anytime. <laughs> like why? That's why is it different, bro? Why is it different? You can do it. He can do it too, right? Equal rights, bro. Let's be serious. Sometimes it's literally because we're just friends. We equal, bro. Mm -hmm. What other reason are they following models on Instagram? Because they want to be friends. Christina does make a valid point, and although I do, uh, that if that you can follow, him, he can follow him too, bro. Standard, I won't because we're here to help Christina, not argue. So since Tristan is a musician who gets hired to play in LA all the time, the plan was to hire him to play at a birthday party later tonight. So let me ask you this, then. So why not just break up with him? Why not? Just because I love him. Part of me loves him, and you know, no. If he fails, he's actually like brain dead. You're literally. But the thing is, he, no. If he fails, I'm actually gonna be mad at him myself. Because <laughs> what the heck? I know. But the thing is, men just want all types of bad. Yeah. They they literally. Why is it like never enough? Like you can never be that's satisfied. Because they just want attention. That's how, they want to know that they can pull. I'm like so. I'm. I feel really bad because she already came out all the way from Vegas for this dude. On a scale of one to ten, how confident are you that he's going to pass the test? Cat cat boy for the fail, bro. Three. Cat boy for the fail. Already, I'm already seeing it now. And mentally, I think I am. Yeah. Like, do I want to trust him? Yes. Yeah. Do I want him to not fail? Yeah, but. 
<laughs> I'm sorry. Listen, I'm really... it's just up to him and God right now. That's all we're leaving it to. <laughs> I feel that. No, I feel uh -huh. that. If God is like trying to get him out of my life, then it's going to happen today. Yeah. Let's hope that his intentions are just to get the bag and go. Yeah, right? that's so fat. That's what he's here for. So him coming here is for the gig. All he's got to do is just bring you up. Just be like, I have a girlfriend. Uh, I love my girl. See, that's in Done. the perfect world. I'm really hoping. <laughs> I'm really hoping for that, but you know. It's not the world we live in today. Exactly. Oh, man. Do you think it's just our day and age, or do you think it's always been like this? Definitely our day and age due to social media. 100%. Oh, all the rap songs these days, too. Oh, oh my God. Man, dude was bad cheating since day. Yeah. People yeah. been cheating since the, the dawn of time, bro. Let's Taylor. be serious. <laughs> what? Like, all the rappers, like, oh, I got 10 bitches. Like, I go to strip clubs. I think that in... Yeah. That definitely adds to it. Cause I mean, yeah, it plays a part, but like, let's be like, people has been cheating since the dinosaurs, bro. Like, let's, let's be real, since cavemen. They was cheating, bro. They was cheating, bro. We got it from somewhere. People got it from somewhere, but they've been cheating forever, bro. It's not because of the, the internet. I mean, the internet plays into it a little bit, but they've be been like doing that, bro. It the ain't nothing new. To what you guys might be thinking, neither Madeline nor Violet is going to be our decoy today. We actually hired Fonty's girlfriend for the job. You guys remember him, right? The man who tackled George. Yo, yo, oh, oh, yo. Fonty, Fonty. Fonty. Yeah, so since Tristan was oh, a musician, okay. we wanted our decoy to have some knowledge in his genre of music. And as you can see from these pics, Fonty and his girlfriend Kenzie were the perfect candidates. After giving Fonty the rundown, we shared Tristan's number with Kenzie and she began hitting him up. Supposedly, she got his number because she heard him playing at a venue in LA and asked the venue for his information. Kenzie would go on and tell him that she was throwing a birthday party and she wanted to hire him and other musicians to perform. As usual, she offered him some pretty good money and eventually Tristan agreed. With everything set, we booked Kenzie's home and flew the couple out. Yeah, these guys were rocking out in London. Fonty and his girlfriend should be at the house soon, but they're taking a minute, so we came to grab some Chipotle in the meantime, because we are hungry. What up? <laughs> Dang, I want some Chipotle. All the way from London, good All to see way. you again. Fonty, we got Fonty in the house. <laughs> Hey, what's up? Kenzie, right? Yes. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet Sergio. You. With our decoy finally now here, all that was left to do was make sure Tristan was almost here. Hi, Tristan. I was just making sure you're still coming early to like check the setup and everything like that. Yeah, I'm about 30 minutes out. Okay, perfect. And then you got the gas money that I sent you, right? I did, thanks for that. Okay, perfect. Yeah, no problem. Just let me know if Yo, you Yo, hold more. on. This is totally and out of... Okay, bro, with these nails, how do you wipe your ass with these nails, bro? Like real life, bro. Real life, you gotta be stabbing yourself in a butthole or something, bro. Cause there's no way you can do that, bro. It's no way. It's no way. They're literally sharp as a knife. Okay, perfect. And then you got the gas money that I sent you, right? What? I did. Thanks for that. Okay, perfect. Yeah, no problem. Just let me know if you need any more. And then I just wanted to let you know I have a meeting the right are before pointy, you. Bro. So whenever that's done, like we're all good to go. All right, I'll see you in a bit. All right, just let me know whenever you get here. All right, see ya. All right, bye. And with that, we finished setting everything up, got into our positions, and waited for Tristan to arrive. That is for you okay. to watch and listen in. All right, you got this. Obviously, flirt. Do what you got to do. Well, don't flirt too much. Oh, he's calling. I think he's here. Hello. Oh, he's here. Oh, he's here. Hey, I'm at your place. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, I'll meet you at the front. All right, see you in a minute. All right, sounds good. Bye. Man, it's doofing a fold, bro. All right, check it. You can flirt with them, not too much. Because you know up. I'm going to be in the background. I'm watching you. Shut up, come I'm on. watching you. God, fuck you, don't f*** this up. <laughs> oh, wait, he's coming. Oh, my God, here he's coming, he's coming. Hello, how are you? Very well, yourself? Doing good. It's so nice to meet you. He looks a little, I mean, he looks like he could pass. This is Fonty. He's going to be performing later, but hey, I just had a meeting up, with man? him. You good? Yeah, decent yourself. F hammered, honestly. Sweet. <laughs> Love it. All right. I'll see you later. Yeah. So right. eight. Eight Yeah, PM? eight. Cool. All right. Well, this is my home. Remember how Kinsey told Tristan that she had a meeting before his arrival? Well, that meeting was with Fonty. Yeah, tonight's going to be really fun. But yeah, I'll show you where you'll be performing. To make this thing realistic, Fonty was pretending to be an artist who was also performing at Kinsey's birthday party later tonight. Hopefully instead of feeling singled out or that this is weird, Tristan instead of thinks, oh, she's probably meeting with everybody that's performing tonight. I was thinking somewhere right here, if that's okay. I have friends coming. They're gonna like move this table and everything like that and make sure nothing's in the way. That way you have as much room as possible. Um, is that okay right here? Yeah, I can work with this. Okay, cool. Damn, he sounds like Captain America. <laughs> <laughs> How much is it in there? That guy's a f cool. <laughs> tool? I do not like him. Really? He 
for no. the outside. I was making sure you're okay performing inside because my neighbors are just Karens. But yeah, I'm really hoping tonight goes well because it's my birthday. And so definitely happy so. birthday, by the way. Thank you. Yeah, I'm. I hate getting older, but you know. I left throwing a good party. Our test was in full swing. And it's funny, this man gave a look when he found out where he was gonna be playing, but money talks. He agreed to play here. All right, well, I brought you over here. Reason one, to check out the space and everything like that. Reason two, I was wondering if you wanted to play two sets tonight. Um, one at seven and one at 11, because I wanted you to sing happy birthday to me. Your second set can be like three songs but I was making sure if that was okay with you. I'd be happy to do that. Okay, perfect. Well, we can also sit down so we don't have to stand the entire time. So since you'll be playing two sets, I definitely will pay you double. I'm not gonna cheat you out of money or anything like that. But yeah, my friends showed me like videos of you playing and I was like, oh my God. I fell in love. I know some of you hate when I do this, but we are gonna pay this man for his time. Maybe not everything, but we are gonna give him something for driving out here. How long have you been playing for? Uh. Most of my life. Oh, All right, let's wow. see if you fold, bruh. Yeah, my dad always wanted me to teach the guitar, but my nails are too long, so. Oh, okay. <laughs> All righty, Josh, you can cue Madeline and Violet to make their entrance. So Good I need luck. to turn the car off. Okay, I'm gonna leave my bag Perfect. here. Who's the decoy? I thought, I thought the girl that was on the couch was a decoy. What? Are they both, are they all yeah, three to the decoys? Three versus one? Really, to who? Oh, I've had a lot of students. Really? So, yeah. Oh yeah, I bet they all fall in love with you. I got the balloon. I got the balloons. Yeah, and I'm not strict or anything, so like if you feel, if you wanna stay for the party, definitely feel free. You can stay, we can take shots later, and then if you don't have anything going on after the, tonight, cause you're not gonna be performing the whole night. Yeah. So yeah, if you definitely wanna hang out and party with us, you can. He has a professional tone to him. Awesome yeah, definitely. Oh, I think that might be catering. Here Violet and Madeline. I told you the party's gonna be good. Oh yeah. Oh, you're not catering. Hello, Hi. guys. Happy birthday. Thank you. Oh my god, hello. Madeline and Violet are pretending to be Kenzie's friends that are here for her party. The goal is to make this thing more believable. Oh, this is Tristan, by the way. Oh, hi. He's gonna be playing the gig tonight. He's singing me happy birthday. Oh, oh. This, is the, this is the cutie. I can see the thoughts birthday. running through his hand, bro. I can I can literally see the thoughts running to his, through his hand right now. Thinking of all the fantasies that are going through his head, bro. You, you can see it, bro. It's literally clearly on his face right now, bro. You can see it, bro. Okay. You can see what he's thinking, hi, bro. Tristan. I'm so excited to hear you sing. I know, it's He's gonna fail, bro. I'm calling it. I'm so excited. He's gonna yeah. fail, bro. Yeah, Right here. Oh, it's yeah. the way you don't feel. I mean, don't open them yet. I won't pee. Yeah, don't open them. Don't open but them. I honestly feel like that's enough balloons. No, we should fill it. Madeline and Violet are supposedly responsible for filling the home with decorations and balloons. They came over to get a scope on how many things they will need. What? Boring when you don't have nobody to talk to. Holy. We got like a, a balloon arch. Oh, Ooh, that, that would, would be so too. cool. Hey, still doing good. Not looking at them. Damn, he's on his phone. They're supposed to be trying to get him involved into the conversation. <laughs> Just started talking on their own. This is perfect. Okay, he's, he's not looking at their asses. Yeah, he's actually doing good. He's actually doing good. I'm not going to lie. He's actually doing good. How long do you think we have? I think like three hours. It's true. It's I'm true. like so locked in. I'm like making sure that head doesn't turn. <laughs> like, do not look at their asses. <laughs> it's not dirty. This is making me feel better. If Set anybody's up. got it, it's us. We got it. Y'all are so we right. We got it. Y'all are so right. <laughs> I'm sorry for pausing so much, but like he's actually a soldier, bro. I feel like 99.8% of dudes would have turned around at least one time, bro. It's just a natural instinct of a man, bro. How did he not turn around, bro? He's like, he has a strong probably, will, bro, because I would have turned on. around. I ain't gonna lie. I, know, I ain't like, gonna lie. Make me feel really good, actually. I would have turned around. Bro. So how is this to attend to here? Oh, I'll leave you guys to it. <laughs> oh my God. Don't have too much fun with this. Stop. I'm watching you. <laughs> And so with that, Madeline and Violet successfully complete their mission. No, nah, he's gonna pass now. Oh I ain't gonna lie, he's gonna pass. He's gonna pass. They're ridiculous. He's gonna pass. <sighs> Sorry about that. Also, shout out to Tristan for passing a little mini test, I guess. Go let Madeline and Violet know that he didn't look. Okay, perfect. Where were we? Yeah, like I said, we have a few people coming. They're bringing like the lights, the amps, stuff like that. Your girl's really ringing him in. I see why she got you. Hey, <laughs> listen. Oh, I completely forgot to mention. I thought about it'd be cool if you played in the garage, we can go look at it. I'll show you. All right, guys, come on in, come on in, come on in. Okay, so in here, I know there's a lot of stuff in here, but we can get everything cleared out. Kinsey takes Tristan to the garage under a false excuse in order to give us time to sneak Violet, Madeline, and Fonty upstairs. But I mean, we could set up like a stage right here. But I don't know how that affects the acoustics. It's a birthday party, right? It's not like a full show, so I'm not yeah. worried about the acoustics, but it's gonna get a bit hot. That is, it is stuffy. It's really, it's really stuffy in here. Um, 
I don't know. I feel like inside would definitely be better, especially I feel like this place echoes so bad. I don't know. You could do your second set in here. I don't know. Whatever you want to do. You're the rock star. <laughs> No, whatever. whatever the cool rock star wants. All right, well, we can definitely go back inside. Sure. Huh. Yeah, it feels a lot better in here. With everyone now safely in our control room, Kinsey was free to take this test wherever she wanted. I definitely am really excited to see you perform. I mean, like, the, like I said, the videos that I saw of you, you looked so good. Is it actually you playing or is it recording? It, you can be honest. It's 100% me. Are you sure? Yeah. What part of Vegas are you from? I live near the Arts District. Oh, I've heard it's like a lot like LA. It is and it isn't. That's what I've heard, yeah, I've never been. Really? I really wanna go. All my friends always tell me to go with them, but I'm always scared it's gonna end horribly because their trips always end terribly. I'll have to come whenever you're there. Hit me up. <laughs> I will. Mm. Yeah, I'm from Mississippi. Mississippi? The polar opposite of LA. I, I didn't hear an accent. Oh yeah, it's gone. I live in LA. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Do you ever miss Mississippi? Absolutely not. No? Absolutely not. Not at all. It's horrible there. I hate it. <laughs> really? Why? Yeah. I mean, my family's there, but other than that, I mean, there's nothing there. Like, LA has everything. Definitely. I like your boots. Thank you. Ah, uh, compliment. Uh, They're my going out boots, so of course. Uh, I don't know what's going to happen to them tonight. What do you think of everything so far? <sighs> They're not, fl he's not flirting, but. If I could say something. Me is just like up, like perched up. I think he's just crossing his leg, isn't he? Yeah, he's just crossing his leg. Yeah, he's just crossing his leg. I'm gonna go so close. He's like, back up off my girl. For the record, I don't like your boyfriend. Whose loyalty test is this? <laughs> <laughs> Have you played like for any house parties or is this your first one? I've lost count of how many house parties. I've really? Played. But it's been a long time because we started playing like house parties. Yeah. And then it was, you know, bars and then clubs and then theaters and then big open air festivals. That's crazy. So this is like, <laughs> I haven't gotten the call to do a house party in a long time. Oh, well, I'm glad to bring it back to you, bring you back to your roots. Damn, honestly, I didn't know this man had it like that. No wonder he made that face when he found out he was going to play in the dining room. Clearly, the money we offered him, though, is the reason he said yes. So how many people are in your group or your band? We're a four piece. R a four piece? <laughs> like chicken nuggets? <laughs> I have a great idea. Yeah? I think you should play me like a preview of what you're gonna play tonight. Did you bring your guitar? Well, of course you brought it, but where is it? It's in my car. We can go get it. I wanna kinda wanna see it like before everybody else does. Something about it. Yo, this dude is not following, bro. It's something about it, I love it. I it's, a, it's honestly bad. I she ain't made the movie happen, yet though. But I love him. I love him so much. And it's my birthday, so, you know, we can go get it. It's, you didn't park far, did you? Down the street. Okay. I think we should walk there. Sure. I'll come with you. Let's go. All right, let's go get it. Oh, you lead the way. I have no clue where we're going. <laughs> Wait, what's happening? That's that's true. Oh, opening my own door for me. Thank you. You lead the Gentlemen. way. Gentlemen, okay. Part. I'm right over there. Go ahead. Okay, perfect. You know, it doesn't feel too good. It's starting to feel worse. Bad. It's like it's not blatant flirting, mm -hmm. but it's you can tell. Being that he had nowhere else to go, Tristan had been planning on staying in the area until it was his time to play. Which explains why he was nonchalantly just hanging around. Because technically at any time he could have just been like, alright, are we done with meeting? I gotta get out of here. But where was he gonna go? I mean, he did mention that he knew some people in the area, but maybe they just weren't available. Oh, it's a yeah. nice case. Yeah, yeah, it is. It is. What kind of guitar is it? I've no, I don't know anything about guitars. I don't even know why I'm asking. <laughs> Let's get to the preview. I'm so excited. Yeah, try not to disappoint. Let's figure out the best place for you to set up. Oh, Maybe over uh, here? Just sit down here and play a bit. Okay. Perfect. Uh, let's see. I'll warn you, it's uh, been driving for four hours. It's okay. Been, Even if it's out of days. tune, it's fine. Well, oh, it's beautiful. Yeah, yeah, she's pretty nice. Oh my gosh. <laughs> uh, let's see if I can still remember how to play. Ah, uh, I ain't gonna lie. Now let's put the loyalty test on a decoy, because I go a lot. If a dude can play a guitar, bro, in front of a girl, bro, he got her. Let's be real, bro. He got her, bro. If he plays his guitar good, good enough, bro, your girl is gone, bro. Let's be real. Your girl is gone, bro. Oh. Oh, his girl is gone, bro. <laughs> Even though she's a decoy, bro. Yeah, he's good at what he does. He's surprisingly really good. What the heck? He might even have me. <laughs> Pause. She's digging it. Oh my Bombs. god. Oh my god, this girl's gone. This girl's gone! <laughs> Wait! Yo, he's actually nice though! That's wild! <laughs> he 
Yo, yo. Okay, let's do, let's do something. Like yo, bro, just, bro just sauced me a little bit. I didn't even go live, bro. You just sauced me a little bit. You just sauced me a little bit, bro. Yo, he's actually good at the guitar. Really? I do. Oh. Oh yeah, she's biting her fingernails. Yeah, it's over. We didn't flip the switch on it, bro. <laughs> she's stressing. <laughs> I don't know, bro. I don't like him. All right, do you believe now that I can actually play? Yeah, well, I'll take experience? your word for it. Right on, right on. Uh, she likes you're gonna that, make bro. tonight really fun. All right, I'm just gonna say it because everybody's thinking it. This man does not need game when he's got skills and can serenade right. a girl like that. Right. I mean, he's got Fonty worried, and he should be. Guys, go show Fonty some love. Tell him it's gonna be okay. Tell Kinsey not even to I'm worried. worried. At it. Well, That's amazing. Know, I, I'm not even warmed up. That's just me. Really? Ooh, I'm not even warmed wait, up. Wait till you actually see me playing a show. Oh, oh, are you inviting me to a show? No. I'll put you on my guest list. Oh my god, uh, guest list. I play LA all the time. I'm playing uh, LA next month, actually. That's not cheating, but here. like. I'm guest listed, are you kidding? Clearly, girls like Tristan for mm. his good looks or for his guitar skills. We're about to find out how far he goes with it, though, and if he's living that rock star lifestyle. But no, we'll set up everything. Hopefully, they bring like the stage and the lights and everything, because I feel like that'll add to it. I'm ready to hear you. That was a look. Yeah. I mean, like I said, out there, I think I invited like 30, 40 people. But I mean, you know how it is. They like, they bring a plus one and then the plus one brings a plus one. So it's probably gonna be packed in here. So hopefully you don't get nervous about how many people are in here. How many people have you performed for? Like what's the oh, biggest yeah. number? 6,000. 6,000? Yeah. Yeah, I wasn't expecting that big of a number. It's, it's not That's a bad crazy. Number. It's not a bad number. Has he really? Definitely not. He's just trying to flex on her right now. Yo, he's and capping get nervous in front of them. After years of <laughs> night after night. Yo, what's his phone? I guess that's true. I don't know. I I would get so nervous. I don't know how you don't Yo, do it. Yo, he's capping. <laughs> oh, it's over. He's gonna play. He's well, gonna. He's gonna fold, bro. I mean, what are you doing tomorrow? No plans yet. No, Monday. don't do it, bro. Don't, don't do it. Vegas. Don't do it. Monday. Oh, okay, so you're here for like the entire weekend. Yeah. Well, no. if it's not too forward. I was going to oh, see if we hang out tonight bro. and we'll get to know each other. But tomorrow we can hang out one on one and get to know each other more. All right, here we go. Plus, I mean, tomorrow we can go to like bars and stuff like that. Definitely. So we can just oh, do it all again. Oh, man. <laughs> this dude, is, he, he, he failed, bro. So are bro. you like seeing anybody? No. Really? It's over. He failed. No. 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 It's a cold world out here, man. Make sure you got a coat. Make sure you got a coat. It's a cold world, bro. It's a cold world, man. Hey, man. Just stay single the rest of, the rest of your life at this point, no bro. No girlfriend? 2024, just stay single, man. 2025, stay single, bro. Just like bro. a bunch of crazy fangirls. It's over, bro. Oh, yeah, of course. Oh, I mean, I'm man, like no. <laughs> well, I mean, if you would be down, yeah, tomorrow we'll, we'll go and we'll hang out one-on-one. -on -one. We'll get man, to know each no, other. Bro. I mean, have you ever taken, like, any of your fans or whatever seriously? Like, have you, like, do you date to date them or do you just, like, hook up with them, ghost them, and leave? Uh, I just want to know that I'd be taken seriously and I wouldn't be lied to. Oh my god, bro. Stop. You promise? I promise. Okay, perfect. Pinky promise. Pinky you promise. can't break that. Oh, ew. Perfect. Well, then tomorrow, Oh, man. Yeah, Pinky Promise we'll is crazy, out. bro. Then we can get it's over. He failed. Pinky Promise. He done Pinky Promised her. He just said he was going to take her out, get some drinks. Man. Stay single the rest There's of your no life. Stay single the rest of your life. But it's not working, bro. It's Hopefully not working, bro. It's not working, bro. another one-on-one show tomorrow. Uh, oh, he went one-on-one -on -one show. Oh, this is... Damn. It's over, bro. This it's over. Grand. It's over. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. I don't even know... It's no point of being saying anything more. He tripping on she bad. Uh, we can just spend all day. Oh, you can uh, even crash here. I've got a guest bedroom if you have to. I would be coming home. Christina now had a decision. He fumbled hard. Did she want to keep this thing going to a second day, or has she heard enough? What's your favorite spot here? Gosh, I don't even know. I really don't. Let's go to the. We could go up Sunset and we'll hit up the beach. We have to. Yeah. I mean, I've been trying to fall in here. love with her, bro. Going to the beach is crazy. You need to keep listening to it. No, definitely not. I think we should. 
Go press him. Go Just press him. Let's get it over with. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not trying to put salt in the wound here, but it sounds like he's done this before. Like, no, he definitely he have. Yeah, he's experienced. Definitely knows his strategy. Yeah, yeah. he's experienced. He's an experienced cheater. Let's see. So, yeah. it's better to know the truth. Yeah. No, I'm done. So this is enough for you then. You don't want to keep it going. You don't want to see if he actually shows up to like a date. And what is there else to see? He just it came out a whole date with her, and I'm standing right up here. No, I've I've seen everything I need to see. Yeah. That's it's all clear. He fumbled, bro. He that fumbled the bag. It. What am I gonna do? Stay with him? <laughs> be okay he's gonna talk to every single girl like that mm -hmm. no not even giving him the benefit of the doubt nothing no for what he told her he's not seeing anyone and then what he's gonna come back home to vegas and yeah. tell him tell me how much he loves me i think i'm ready to go let's go okay. talk to him I thought we were going to take things into a day two, but this thing was short and sweet. Christina was cutthroat. She is a no-nonsense type of girl. And hey, I don't blame her. She doesn't want to waste her time. Now, is this the worst the channel? Why, you already got a girl? In fact, Man. I think Tristan was trying to keep things professional, which is why his responses quiet, were bro. short, sweet, Let me just be quiet. confused. But what really did him in was denying having a girlfriend. Why deny it? Why deny it? I'll take you to Mississippi. Yeah. You can come see Mississippi. Yeah, that There's not fun. much there. I hope you guys got your talking to Hold on, this dude's a doofus, bro. This dude's a doofus. Oh my god, this, is, this dude's a doofus, bro. <laughs> this dude's a doofus. Like, who's your brain, man? So this is what you're doing when you're working. <laughs> right, lying and sneaking oh, around? Man. Trying to get at bitches? Uh, what's with the, um... How are you gonna be with another bitch and act stupid right now? Why are you here, man? Are you slow? We just saw you asking this girl out and trying to go on a date with her. We've been watching you this whole time. Watching me? You call this business? Uh, yeah, I was booked to play a gig. A, a gig? Where you're asking the client on dates and planning a whole date with her? Are you, you gonna act stupid? We just heard you, we have all the proof we need. Every time it gets to this part of a UDY video, this is when you see top tier gaslight, bro. Let's see, let's see what kind of performance this man puts on, bro. Let's see, if, let's see so his gaslight skills, bro. It's been a loyalty test. None of this is real. Let's like see what he Kinsey does, bro. doesn't really live here. This house is actually a rental. It's not her birthday tomorrow. There is no birthday party tonight. Madeline and Violet aren't really her friends. And there is no gig. Nobody's coming to play to the party tonight. This was all just like an elaborate plan to help Christina find out if you'd say loyal to her or not. She was upstairs watching and listening in the entire time and she heard you deny having a girlfriend. She heard you saying that you weren't seeing anybody and yeah. A loyalty test. Wow. So you set me up. Yeah. You said you're not dating me. <laughs> Look, why are you even mad? I mean, I was just... I was just telling her what she wanted to hear. She's a client. I wasn't gonna like. Oh, she's anything. a client. So ah, you said you weren't serious. She's a client. Just telling yeah, me what yeah. she wanted to hear. You know, like, uh, you know, you could have just talked it over. Like, why did you go to all this trouble? This is paranoid. This is just. I'm just processing this right now. Like, this is insane. What is there to process? You got caught cheating. You're oh. trying to get another. You you said we were nothing serious. Are you gonna now let's be honest. Putting somebody on a loyalty test is pretty crazy. Like I ain't gonna lie. Like just if you think they cheating, bro, just break up with them. But we wouldn't have videos like this if it wasn't right for people now, that didn't trust a uh, significant that what she other. So to hear? I appreciate yeah. it. Your client, your client. Is that what she wanted to hear? I just needed to get the job done. You look like a dumb f right now. Why, <laughs> what are you doing? Is this business? Uh -huh. <laughs> is this business? How is this a job? You're not playing. You're not doing anything. You're just trying to get at her. I mean. I can't, I, I can't even believe you're mad right now. Like, I'm the one who should be mad. Like, I got dragged all the way out here and I- So you don't, out. so you don't think you did anything wrong? Is what you told Kinsey, did you just tell her that just to say it? Like, like were you lying wrong. or do you- I've been scammed, man. Like, <laughs> you dragged me all the way out here from Vegas. Like, I brought my stuff and now you find out there's no <clears throat> Who's gonna pay me for all of this? Is Who's that the- that that's the only thing you care about. Sure. I'll be worried about my money too, bro. I ain't gonna lie. We're gonna pay you like for the gig and all that stuff, but we will give you something. Well, I want my ring. Why are you only focused on the money right now? Uh, no. Nah. For the gig and all that stuff, but we will give you something. Well, I want my ring. Why are you only focused on the money right now? <laughs> yeah, of course your broke ass wants it. Bro, you Dang. Got by my girl, and you're about to lose yours. You're you might as well just f nut up and just admit you're to You're literally losing up. me right now, and you just the only thing you care about is trying to get out of poverty. I'm guessing. I'm a working man, you know. Man's got to make a living. Right. You want it? I feel it, bro. I, need, I would need my money too, bro. Apologize to her. I okay. Don't, I don't know if that will fix Apolo things right now, but it's a start. Apologize. Apologize for what? Can you spell narcissist? You set me up. <laughs> Maybe for <laughs> trying to get at another girl. Yeah, bro. You're still in the wrong, bro. You cheated, man. You have.
have like this gorgeous model perfect girlfriend. Yeah, you girlfriend. sat here saying you didn't have a girlfriend the entire time. And you were like, oh, it's whatever, where's my money? That makes you a cheater. I was You're just cheating. trying to get through the job so I could get my money and get home to pay. I think you need to just pack up your things and leave. So if this were real, you don't think anything would have happened? You don't think that you guys would have had a drink tonight? Yeah, we're supposed to like not go on a date in LA not tomorrow. You don't think none of that was Absolutely gonna happen? Not. So you were just saying everything just to say everything? Like I said, you know, I got hired for the job and you know, it's my job to keep her happy, right? Right, okay, so he's clearly not gonna admit to anything. I, there's no point. <laughs> keeping her down, keeping her happy? Yo! Where the f my money? Oh do you my think, do you think? Oh. Yo, just get him at his money and let's call it right off, now. bro. Because I'm... You don't care about losing me, you don't care about your reputation, but you care about, what, the money? So you're a con man. A, a con man? Look, <laughs> look at this! I just got, I just told her I was here for a gig, like this is the con. You got caught in the act, bro, shut the f*** up. The you, Tristan, just, sit down. Just, just leave. You what are you posing? Pose just it. leave. Now look at you. 6,000 people. She said you didn't even f***ing play to 300 people. I did play for 6,000 people. Pose it. Tristan. 6,000. Why are you even mad? I'm the one who got dragged out here and scammed. This is just a total scam. You're a bunch of, who the f*** are you anyway? My name's Fonty. Fonzie. I've yeah. never heard of him. Fonzie, no, no, no. Bro, no, no, no. can you not just not leave? Can you get the f*** out? You're actually embarrassing me right now. You're actually embarrassing me. I'm gonna go try to find a real gig. Why don't you? I'm in LA. Maybe you'll be able to get out of poverty too. Uh, Dang! That's a low blow, bro. So did you really? Can y'all just pay the man his money, bro? <laughs> Look at my Instagram, bro. It's all there. <laughs> you, I'm trying to help you out, bro. I think maybe there's still a possibility that you could save your relationship if you talk to your girl, come clean to your girl, apologize. I don't know something. Apologize, apologize for what? You cheated, I'm man. Scam, man. You attempted to cheat on her with me. You, I was just playing along. That you should. Grab that guitar and play the same sh you played for my girlfriend and see if you can win her ass back. Maybe I'll grab hey, that guitar and smash it over here. Oh, bro. Okay, this is getting uh some elementary school uh, roast. That's so cute. I'm walking away with my girlfriend, you just lost yours, bro. So have fun wanking your I ain't gonna lie, bro. You really can't be saying that because he literally sauced your girl with a, with the guitar playing, bro. Let's be real, bro. If she was single, bro, she would have she would have folded, bro. It's a fact. It's a fact. Hey, by the way, this is a rental. Unless you want to pay, actually, you can't. Back to Mississippi or wherever the. Mississippi. That's right. Mississippi. She's from Mississippi, and you were just hitting on her. Hey. Go back to the 2000s, bro. The 2000s. He wants a hairstyle. He might hear going like this. He's 2012, bro. Gene Simmons wants a hairstyle. Yeah, does he? I don't know what the hell was happening or going on. These two rock stars were about to throw hands. What were these insults, though? If all you're concerned about is money, if your phone is connected to your Zell, we'll Zell. Come on, princess. You and your 6,000. People are outside. Hey, bro, that's 6,000 more people than your ass has ever played for. Yep. Well, at least I'm honest. Uh, Biggest crowd I've ever for was 500. Overrated. Sold out. He's Sick. overrated just like your fing hair stuff. Yeah, dude, that's all you say is my fing hair stuff. Uh, babe, Maybe sit by the line. Nice knowing you. Oh, yeah. Guys. Goodbye, loser. Oh, bye. Bye, bye sweetheart. Have fun in Vegas. People. 6,000 people in my ass. <laughs> yeah, guys, piece of sh. Dang. And that's it for this video, bruh. Moral of the story, don't cheat. Also, just stay single, bruh. That's how you avoid cheaters, bruh. Also, learn how to play the, play the guitar, because that's sauce, bro. You, you can literally get any girl you want if you can play the guitar, bro. And yeah, that's going to do it for this video. Like the video, subscribe if you're new, man. And we out.